More now on new vaccines that are being developed to target co new COVID-19 variants. Britain's GlaxoSmithKline and Germany's CureVac are teaming up to produce an inoculation that will offer protection against multiple variants. And for more, we're joined by Dr. Bharat Pakhania from the University of Exeter. Uh, Dr. Bharat, how would the collaboration improve on existing vaccines? It adds to our momentum of existing vaccines. So we will be, uh, all, one, adding additional numbers of vaccines and two, additional capabilities for when these uh, viruses uh, change their makeup and need additional or changes to the mRNA uh, to mirror the spike proteins that are in circulation. And Dr. Bharat, would such a new vaccine capable of targeting multiple variants replace the existing ones that we have now? On, we, we will only replace the existing ones if we know that they are ineffective. So even if they are marginally effective or m effective in the majority of cases, we use them because we have a global pandemic which we wish to get on top of. Furthermore, going forward, we will find that uh, using a what you would call multiple valency vaccine, in other words, uh, it, the, the one vaccine has components for several variants and it does the job, may become the main vaccine to be used. Uh, could you give us some context then? Has such a vaccine ever been developed of being able to target multiple strains? Yes, no problem at all. It is uh, eminently possible and doable. So, for example, we've got the pneumococcal vaccine, and that targets multiple strains of the pneumococcus bacteria. And similarly, we've got the HPV vaccine, which uh, targets several variants, various strains of the human papilloma virus. So this is nothing new or unusual. In fact, it would be a pretty good idea to have a vaccine which has already in it um, um, uh, immune generating capabilities against several variants of one strain. Well, GlaxoSmithKline has called this the next generation vaccine. What does GSK mean by that? And, and will you know, this new vaccine put us a step ahead of the pandemic? It's a, this is early days. So for us to have uh, conquered the pandemic, it's going to take time, especially as we've got to immunize so many people globally. But the pandemic will eventually go. What we are very, very excited about is this new platform of vaccines, these messenger RNA type vaccines. They can be quickly reformulated, they can be quickly generated in the laboratories, and therefore we can find vaccines for uh, meds, uh, for infections that we didn't have before. So I'm really looking forward to, for example, these vaccines being used for a better TB vaccine, maybe a vaccine for malaria, maybe a vaccine for dengue fever, and maybe for other infectious diseases that thus far we haven't had good vaccines or no vaccines.